family and friends this is Rob the Sapper Gardener representing Essiance Family Garden and today I'm gonna do a real quick uh, update on our garlic we did a garlic video a few months ago uh, back in late October early November I'll put an I card up there and one of the things that we did we had some rust on one of our garlics and uh, I use a trick that I got from Jim at Simply Garden and Home and uh, I'm gonna show the garlic that didn't have it and the garlic that we use Jim's trick on so hang tight so first we're actually going to start with some uh, shallots that we put out and the shallots are all doing good uh, our weather has been fairly mild here in Virginia zone so 7a but the shallot and this is the italian shallot is doing well and french shallot is doing well also looks like we've got a hundred percent germination rate with that and the garlic and what we're going to call garlic alley this year it was tomato alley last year but all the garlic that we put over here is doing well we do need to come out and uh, weed some of the men out while it's cold before it uh, just explodes in the summer as it likes to do and we've got several different type of garlic over here and yeah all that's doing well some is doing better than others uh, this bed with the Siberian garlic is growing but we got some uh, bulbs that did not go up or some cloves that did not come up. But uh, overall, all this healthy garlic that we got is doing well. So let's go take a look at the garlic that we treated with Jim's method. So we had two bulbs that had some rust on them. And our friend Jim at Simply Gardening Home had talked about um, soaking your garlic in alcohol or more specifically with uh, vodka so we tried that instead of just throwing the garlic out uh, we took the cloves which one something's dug it up I'll replant that but uh, we soaked it in uh, vodka for about an hour uh, I took it out and I wasn't quite convinced it was still going to be viable because it did get a little mushy afterwards but we planted it anyway and we have almost a hundred percent success rate so uh, Jim thank you for showing us that trick uh, I'll link to his video uh, where he put his garlic out as well as to our video uh, where we did it and uh, just pleasantly surprised this garlic is doing great no ill effects from the alcohol soak whatsoever and uh, we'll just see if it tastes like vodka when we harvest it and we have more garlic over here and this garlic came from uh, our saved garlic uh, we took that and we put it out so we should have plenty of garlic left and when we get these grow bags moved over to the garage garden and to the micro orchard uh, we may try putting some onions in them in the spring uh, not quite sure what we'll do but uh yeah we want to clear this space for uh different uses so as always this is rob the sapper gardener wishing or saying god bless our great country america you wherever you reside around the world your garden your harvest your kitchen your meals and especially your family to have health success and prosperity take care sapper out